of y'all I wanted to do okay so I get I know I've been kind of MIA the last couple of days I might I think I might have caught a little bit of what my daughter had so I had not really felt good but I had my little um, uh, not an unboxing I'm a little package I got in from uh, Missouri Star yesterday it was only three items um they were having a sale and I got these two little charm packs they were like three dollars and some change um, one is the 30s Playtime by Lindsay Cole McRae. That seems right. And Moda. And the other is the Jelly and Jam. So these are like $3 and some change. I'm going to try to start collecting these when these are on sale. Because I think I have in mind something cute for these. All of them I make in. Or I get in. The second thing, or the other thing I got in was a new t-shirt. And this was under $20. So it says Jenny and Natalie and Misty and me, Missouri Star. I've eyed this shirt for a while, but I didn't want to get it until they went on sale. So, I got it. They had some others on sale, but they were um, the V-neck, and I don't like V-neck. I could probably should try them, though. I haven't. I mean, they don't go far down, but I don't know. I, I just like my t-shirts. Um, I also finished all six of my boards, all six of these. I know you saw this one, but I finished, and this one's on, but I finished these just a little bit ago. Um, I think I'm about to do, um, I need to finish my foundation paper piecing before I start this. I need to sew these blocks together for that pillow. So, um, you know what? I want to go ahead and sew this since y'all are on. Yeah. I guess I'll go ahead. Where's my paper? So I guess I'll go ahead and do this. I was going to make the little unboxing video, but I'll go ahead and. That's still too hot. I was going to put that down there, but that's still too hot. But I'll, I'll put my other boards away for now. Those bigger boards I have. I'm going to just put y'all back up here. I went ahead and put my other boards away. Because, um. I'm just not going to do them right now. I don't feel like doing them right now. And I'm not going to. I did pick out some strips though for them. A few of them. Because I had, somebody commented and had a wonderful idea. They go and get that, you know how they have the decorative cute, like, um, duct tape? So instead of the two inch or two and a half inch binding, like the strips, they use duct tape. I may have to go, I may have to go get some, especially for those bigger boards, so I'm not having to use all my glue or my fabric strips. So I'm thinking that's what I may do for my big ones. I thought that was genius. Because they really do have some really cute um, pieces now. Okay, or some, uh, what am I trying to say? They have some really cute um, duct tape. I'm trying, I can't think. So. Okay. L M N. Okay. Oh, I had to put these in order. Okay. I'm gonna paint y'all down. Hopefully, y'all will be able to see what I'm doing and see my sewing. try to get these done I want to go ahead and start on my um what's it called my that pixel quilt that's in a pixel quilt but I want to get these done I also got my payment request 
for um, a payment request for my next flower box block. But, I mean, I paid it, but I need to finish. I haven't even started on that. I cut the block one. I just haven't done the cross stitch. I may try to do that later. I don't know. I may try to do that later. I got my little pin cushion with the bottom. Sorry, all my stickers are on there. Too stuck to it. I got that, I think, in one of my so sampler boxes a few years ago. Yeah, so sorry if this turned into a sewing video. But I might as well. I need to get this done anyways. done. Those bags are still down here in their paper. You know the little, the, the bags I store some of my fabric in there down there and it just fell. Oh, um, I also ordered today, this doesn't count because it's for a, uh, well, but I ordered my bat, my border fabrics. And I don't have my microphone on, y'all. Hold on, let me get my microphone. There. Hopefully that's better. Okay. Anyways, um, I ordered from Fat Quarter Shop. I ordered my um, borders back, not well, just my border fabric because the backing that I had put in my cart, it was sold out already. So I got on Etsy and found it and got it somewhere else. But um, yeah, so I did get my, my background fabric and my border fabric. So, as soon as I'm done with the Santa Pixel quilt, I want to start on that quilt. Of course, I know there's probably going to be some people that have already have... I've got so many other projects going on that I know some people already post some of those videos of those quilts. But that's okay. I'm just behind. Because <laughs> i got my mind preoccupied on everything, you know, other things. That's hot. Hey, y'all can see what I'm doing. One of these days I'll get in the habit of turning the second microphone on. Yeah, I never, like, threw up like my daughter did. I just felt real nauseated all night, Thursday night. Like, it started, I guess, about 8 or so. And then I didn't sleep hardly at all that night. And then I woke up because my stomach, I thought I was going to, it was bad. But I never did. And then um, yesterday... 
four, five, six. And yesterday, I just, I started running a low-grade fever yesterday after, or yesterday, yeah, late afternoon, about three, four o'clock. I took a, took my, because I felt, you know how you feel when you feel like you're running a fever. I mean, it was a low-grade, but, um, don't know why. But, uh, anyways... And me and my husband, we went and got chilies to go because I did not feel like cooking. He was exhausted. He didn't, you know, normally he'll cook sometimes if I don't feel like it. But he was exhausted after being out in this heat all week. And um, so we did chilies to go. And we ate. And by the time we got done eating, we went in there and laid down. I guess it was like 8, 30, 8 maybe 8.30. We crashed. I woke up at about 10. I was like, oh. And quick cadence, she's she's almost she's going on ten years old, so she's not you know, not that she's a little bitty, but uh, I was like, oh my gosh, cadence has been there. I felt bad because I'm like she's been in there by herself. Not that she might, not that she cares. I just I feel bad because I didn't feel good all day yesterday, and so I I was dozed off and I just felt bad. Poor girl was, she didn't care though. I'll, I'll go in the living room and she's dozed off on the couch herself but we slept until almost seven this morning i feel better i feel better i still haven't eaten today it's like one o'clock i think and i haven't eaten since last night at about when we ate about seven and it's like i'm not really hungry like i'm hungry but i'm not no that sounds weird just nothing sounds good I must have had a touch of what she has. It just didn't affect me as bad as her. You know what? I need to put this over some more. So. She's a little mama, though. She's sitting to cover me up. Made me a grilled cheese yesterday. She's like, I'll take care of you, mama. She's a sweetheart. She loves her mama. But, um, yeah, I still haven't eaten today, and I just don't. I did have my husband run up to the store. We have a little convenience store right up the road. And uh, they cook and gas, sell all kinds of stuff. It's a small little store. Anyways, I had him. I was like, you know what really sounds good? A big red. I hadn't had a big red in a while. And one, well, one reason why is because all the sugar. But he ran up there and got me a big red. And, of course, I got the hiccups because, you know, I had nothing on my stomach all night. The first thing I put on it is carbonation. So. But. That's all I've really had. And I, of course, drank water. But not even coffee. Normally, I love my coffee in the mornings. Not even coffee. Like, that makes me, like, just nauseated. God damn it. So, yeah. Maybe it'll hang out like this and I'll lose some weight. <laughs> I'm just joking. I know that's not a good way to lose weight. I'm joking. Kind of. <laughs> I mean, I ate last night and was fine. Just, I don't know. I have chicken out. I was going to make some tetrazzini the night before last, but the chicken was still somewhat frozen, and my husband had to go to praise and worship practice, so I didn't eat. It was the night that I got sick. And I didn't feel like making it last night, so I'll probably make it tonight for dinner. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to eat some of that. I saw a video of this one lady eating a homemade chicken pot pie. From Cracker Barrel. Well, I guess it was homemade. You know what I mean by homemade. It was chicken pot pie. I was like, that sounds that sounds like really, really good. But I don't have the stuff for that. So or I'd make one of those tonight for dinner. Everything's homemade, but I buy the store bought pie crust. I cheat on that. Because it's just too easy. But 
And then Cadence got upset today. Her daddy went out there and worked on her four-wheeler so she could ride. But now the battery don't want to work. And it's too hot. She's just not happy. She keeps trying to go outside. I'm like, Cadence, it's too hot. And she, I want to, I'm like, okay. And she, in about five minutes, she's back in. It's too hot. I'm like, I know, baby. I told you. And I was out there watering this morning. We already have big cracks in the ground. Like, we were flooding here a month ago. Maybe it was the beginning of June. I don't remember when the last rain was. I have to look. But now it's so dry. We got big old cracks in the ground. Okay, there's that middle of that block. It's just, oh, I'm so over it. Over, over, over it. L1. And I can't believe the 4th of July is this week, y'all. I cannot believe, well, Thursday. Like, where has, I told my sister, I was like, I just feel like, I mean, it's just, I don't know, it snuck up on me. I went and got, my husband has a big smoker, well, uh, where the smoker part is, where he puts the wood and stuff, it um, is all rusted out and there's a hole so he can't use it. Well, then we go to grill and the grill grates on it are all just rusted through too. I mean, he's, we've used it for a long time. Well, I was looking at the replacement and I'm like, I'm not going to spend money on that replacement because we're going to have to have one anyway, get a new one anyways, because the smoker part of it, there's, I mean, there's no way of fixing it unless he just totally rebuilds it. But I went yesterday when I went to the dollar store and got a little 15 or $15 little table grill at the dollar store just so we can grill some little hamburgers and hot dogs. So I'm thinking for th the 4th of July, because I don't think we're going to go do anything. We'll probably just do fireworks. But I figured we can use that and grill some hamburgers and some, I love boudin. Grill some of that, maybe some smoked sausage, just grill some stuff. And I can make some potato salad and you know, that kind of stuff. Normally we'll go to my dad's and my sister's. We used to have it here every year. But my family stopped coming because I, I do live so far out. And so we started going to either my dad's or my sister's. This year I think we're just going to stay home. I'm not sure if my husband has to work Friday or not yet. So we just kind of want to stay home and relax i hate getting on the roads too because people drinking and driving so i think we'll just stay home and do something here Y'all can still see what yeah, y'all can still see what I'm doing. Y'all have to tell me if y'all have any plans, what plans y'all have for the fourth. And please don't take my drinking and driving um, comment wrong. I just I don't agree with drinking and driving. been so many lives lost and I really don't want to get in a wreck. Okay, there's that side. I need to go get some liquid IV for my husband. He, 
I really think he had a heat stroke last week, or almost one, because he went back out the day after I said that I would do that live, because he had just called me. The next morning he went out, and he was out maybe an hour or two and working. He calls me and said he's dizzy and lightheaded and shaky again, and so maybe this evening or tomorrow after we get out of the church, I'll have him run me by, because I need to get him some liquid IV. I'm, I'm over this hate. I'm over it. The heat index is already well over 100. Gotta love humidity. All you southern states, y'all understand the humidity. I'm not sure how the humidity is up north, though. This weather's been so crazy this year, it may feel like the south up north now. I do wish we'd get some rain. So after this little block, all I have is one more. And then I can start piecing this whole little thing together. Oh. I did change my blade back from cutting all those little boards with my other blade. I changed my blade back to the good blade. I want to work on my chicken blocks too. I got so much I want to work on. And this is my problem is I get so sidetracked by other things. Okay, there's that other one. But that's another reason why I only did six of those boards for now. Instead of all of them because I need to get some sewing done. I may do, I may finish this block up. Sew these together and then start working on some of my chicken blocks, maybe. I got these stupid gnats. They should have their August foundation paper piecing or kit out soon. Because, what, July 1st is Tuesday? I've been checking because I cannot wait to see what they have. And that's another thing I need to finish. I need to quilt June's. Which, June's, I'm going to display all year though because it's strawberries strawberries my nephew used to say strawberries he sounded like a little italian man he was so cute i forgot i'm supposed to use that other one that other ruler that has that lip on it and i have it I'll just use that. So if y'all do do foundation paper piecing, all you have to do is that. I just now realized. I 
I was using that in that very first block, or the very first little one. Now I'm, I just use mine, my other one with a quarter inch. So if y'all don't have it, y'all can just use it. You don't have to buy it. I watched uh, Missouri Star's um, video yesterday with Natalie and Jenny. I want to make that quilt. It's a really cute layer cake quilt. It takes two layer cakes, of, like a background layer cake and a printed. I got so many layer cakes. I think I'm going to order a background if, I, if um, Missouri Star has another like a solid on sale soon. I'm going to kind of wait to see if I can find one on sale. And I'm going to um, order one and do one. It looks really, really easy. That way I can use up one of my layer cakes. If y'all want me to see, if y'all want to see me do a quilt with Bride's Dream, let me know. And that's what some of these blocks that I cut up, but I can do a full quilt if y'all want me to. Because I don't mind cutting up one of my fat quarter, or my uh, layer cakes to do that either. Because I have a few that I wouldn't mind doing that with to show the fabric off. I'll just have to let me know. Matter of fact, I have one that I was going to make my stepmama, my bonus mom. And, uh, with some of that fabric. I have it, and I just, I've had it for over a year now. We're supposed to be getting a Hobby Lobby, and I cannot wait. Because I'm probably, while they have their sale, I might buy some of that background, like the solids fabric, the creams and whites. I was telling one of my friends this morning that I want to start buying, if I can, when I can, bolts of fabric. Of like the tone on tone, the creams and whites and stuff like that for my backgrounds. So I have them on hand so when I want to do a quilt, I don't have to go and order and wait and do all that. But, anyways. No, I don't need this one. I need this one here. I'm going to grab my great big one. I mean, my husband's anniversary, I think it's two weeks. For Monday, the 15th. Probably celebrate that weekend before. I don't know. I need to talk to him about it. I want to go to Waco, though, because I want to go to Mardell's. I want to go look at some curriculum. So I like to go to Bahama Bucks. I love, love, love Bahama Bucks. Where's that one? So I want to go there too. I think I made my mind up because we didn't do school at all this week because, well, my little one being sick and then I got sick. I think this week I'm not going to do any school. I'm going to concentrate on getting my house organized and cleaned and like really cleaned and organized as far as like going through a bunch of stuff. Like I went to my Thursday before I started feeling bad that afternoon. I went through um, my bathroom and I had stuff in there because I sold Avon. I didn't really sell it. I'm, I signed up for it. That way I could get stuff a little bit cheaper. And same thing with, I don't know if y'all heard of pharmacy. Um, well, I sold it, I got it, you know, sold it and I had so much stuff because 
you should get when you sign up to sell it you get really good deals and get a lot of free product well i had so much stuff in my stuff my cabinets that i have not used that it's probably out of date i just started throwing stuff away i got a big old box full of crap that needs to be thrown out and i'm not even done that it was just out of t uh, a cabinet and a half like half of my you know when you have underneath the sink those two cabinets it was like only one half of that and then one of my cabinets I need to clean out the other. I got three more, and then I have that other half that I need to clean out. But I think I'm going to concentrate on doing that this week because we're not going to. Honestly, we're not going to do school Thursday and Friday. It's the fourth, and just you know how that is. We're not going to do school, so. I think I'm just going to concentrate on doing my housework, getting it organized and in order. Then, we can start back to school. And I want to look, I guess what I was saying is I want to look at some curriculum. Because I'm looking at two different ones and I want to see them in person instead of ordering them. Ordering them. And, uh, so I have some science here already from one, but I want to see this other one I was looking at. Because a couple of the homeschool moms in our homeschool group said they didn't like it. But then I had another couple of moms that they did. Because my little one wants to be a veterinarian and it's called zoology. There's three different levels. And, um, So I like to see it. Let's see, because there's an one of the I know there are other curriculum. There's another zoology course. There's only one year though. But then another friend in my homeschool group sent me something that you can uh, buy, but you download it and print it off yourself. So it's a lot cheaper, and it's like veterinarian. I need to get me an eco tank, one of the Epson eco tanks. I really need to get one of those printers. I think in August I may buy one because um, my husband gets paid five weeks that week, that month. So I think I may, just because it's such a hefty price, I hate spending that much money when we have other bills coming out. I think I may order that and get it in August. Because that would be a really, she could do that science. She's been saying she wants to be a veterinarian for years. My other daughter wanted to be one, but then she saw how much time, how much you have to go to school, and she said, never mind. Child, I hate school. I wish she did. She's, she's so smart. But I was the same way. I hated school. My son, I was trying to get him, he uh, he had his physics teacher tell him he ought to be an anesthesiologist because that was so smart. He's, oh, math whiz. I wish he would have. I was like, well, mom, that's a lot of school. I'm like, well, some of those years, you're actually in residency at the hospital. But I think, I don't know what he's thinking of doing. He was thinking about being a fireman, and then he found out a lot of people were doing it. But I said, they need firemen. Okay. So there's my thing. So now I'm going to start piecing this together. 
just want my kids to make their own way and do good for themselves. I think I'm pressing away from the middle. I love these little boards and I love the color scheme of these. Aren't that just, isn't, I just looked up and saw them. Aren't they pretty? And they match like the off white, that cream color of that batting. I think it's so pretty. Just look up and saw those. And I was like, they're so pretty. It's Saturday and I'm supposed to do a, I'm supposed to do a live tonight. Well, if I don't do a live, y'all know why. It's because I've not been feeling real great the last couple of days. I've got nowhere to go, but like I said, I've just not been feeling. I'm hoping I feel it well enough to go to church. Tomorrow night is our praise and worship night. That means that's going to make a long day because that means my husband's going to have practice probably at 3 30, 4 o'clock. It's going to make a lot for a long day tomorrow. Okay, I need to glue these down. I may go on a live tonight and just do so, some sewing while I'm on the live. How does that sound with you ladies? I may do that. Work on some of my chicken blocks maybe. Have my laptop up next to me so I can kind of keep up with the chat. I wish we could all get on the live together so it's not y'all just seeing my face the entire time. Come on, man. Why does that do that? These blogs are so cute. I just love these. You know what really sounds good? I just got like, let me see if my husband wants to go get some barbecue with me. That's just, I just got all of a sudden urge for barbecue. Got some smoked sausage and brisket. I got a barbecue place up the road. Let me see if he wants to go with me and go get some. That actually sounds good. It's like I got a whiff. You know how sometimes you can just smell stuff? I just got like a whiff of that. That sounds so good. star is so stinking cute i love it i love how straight the lines are oh i love this block it is so stinking cute look how cute that is and that darling i think it goes wait which way does it go no it goes this way yeah it's this but isn't that darling what do y'all think Okay, so we have this one, the flag, and the heart. Okay, and the next one is going to be, I think it's like, the, I guess you would call it the square and a square. 
that one right there. So I am going to get off. I'm going to get off here. And I'm going to see if he wants to do some barbecue. Because I'm actually, I, I, like I said, I haven't eaten all day. And I'm getting, I'm hungry, but that actually sounds really good. And then I'm going to do some stuff and then I can come back and finish this foundation paper piecing. Let me know if y'all want me to do a live. And if so, I'm probably going to have live, have my face there, have my, my laptop here and just sew with y'all and chat with y'all. Y'all chat with each other and all of that. Because um, I enjoy getting to chat with y'all. And I know y'all like to talk to, talk to each other. So just let me know and I can go live um, and we can chit chat for a little while. I hope you're having a wonderful weekend. Um, hope y'all are being safe out there. I know there's been some storms and flooding, so I hope everybody's being safe. I will talk to y'all soon, guys. Bye, y'all.